Hi guys, uh, just a quick update. Um, we don't seem to have an awful lot of time to do anything at the moment. Um, this is uh, the start of my sunflower project. I mean, you can see it's a nice one because it's got multiple flowers. I'm yet to find out if a single flower or multiple flowers are more productive. Um, I did plant them all the way down there but the rest of them went in uh, a month or so later than all the others so I've got a few with flower heads coming out and others that are way behind but hopefully they'll be productive I've grown those down there to see if I can uh, just, as a, just as a trial um, to see if I can grow my own chicken food uh, or at least help subsidise the chicken food over the winter um, the other thing I'd like to show you is if I can get down here between the neglected garden that's been eaten by all the uh, caterpillars because I think everybody's had all the cabbage whites of us more than I've seen for years this year are my uh, tobacco plants now you know you think oh well, that's not bad size that's quite impressive that's near the top now I've started let, letting the plants go to seed try that out I don't know whether you can get all that in there you go these leaves are massive, absolutely massive, and I haven't got little hands. Let's say even the ones at the top, the relatively new ones, are fairly big and I would have been happy with that. But as soon as you get past the first top couple of leaves, even near the top, these things are substantial and as you go further down that's that's when we got hit by a hailstone we did have some hailstone damage um, a few weeks ago but these leaves are absolutely massive I'd say moss buns that's 12 24 from tip to stem they're about 30 inches or more this one's going to be bigger 12 24 yeah yeah maybe 30 inches but they they're wide and they're like say even the ones nearer the top are almost as big but they go all the way down way underneath the canopy that size One's yellowing at the bottom are ready for harvesting. Um, I've let five for the five biggest ones go to seed, and the rest, just the smaller ones, I've uh, topped out. You can't see in there very well. The find one I can show you a bit better. Seed heads start off like that. And just as they get to that sort of size, you can physically just snap them with your finger. And that will allow the plant to put all its energy into leaf growth. Instead of, there you go, you can see that one. Where I've, you can see, so skinny this afternoon. You can see where I've snapped that off. And hopefully that will just carry on putting out leaf growth. There might be a few more buds and uh, down below here the stems are oh, you can see the stems are sort of that sort of thick you know good thickness of a well a lot a lot thicker than a broom handle um, and these are the the flowers
but all in all I'm very happy with these they're very productive and when they say roughly 12 plants um, should be enough for sort of one smoker for a whole year and then some and that's talking about some heavy smoking and now I can well believe it I mean these things are huge leaves I mean you know one leaf after the next all the way round all the way down I mean there's big size leaves one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 13, 14, 15, 16 leaves of this sort of size per plant and this stuff's thick it's like I don't know if you can see but it's like leather and it's now it's starting to get ready it's sticky and tacky I don't know if you can actually see The hairs on the stems and the the leaves you probably can. I can get some shade over there. But these things are absolutely totally and utterly sticky. And the one thing that has surprised me is no obviously I know they're insect resistant and I know but no insects have had a go at these. These holes are from hailstones, the ones you can see, the puncture holes. There's a massive hailstorm. Um, some of the hailstones were a couple of inches in size. And some of these plants are, well that one there is over six foot in height to give you some idea of scale. These are sort of more, you know, four and a half, five foot, but no, really, not really less productive. Um, they have stretched a little bit since they started to flower, some of the ones that I've allowed to flower. Um, they were very, very short and stocky before, but uh, yeah, if you smoke or if you don't, it's worth giving some of these a try next year. Hope you enjoyed that. Take care. Bye-bye.